this video, I will be demonstrating how to prepare the burette and pipette for the titration experiment. We need to rinse both apparatus with water, followed by the chemical solution which they should contain. Prepare a waste beaker. Point the tip of the pipette into the waste beaker and rinse with distilled water. As you rinse, remember to rotate the pipette. Once you are done, just let the water flow out. Make sure you read the instructions carefully and use the correct solution for the pipette. So for this experiment, we are using solution Q to rinse the pipette. We need to use a pipette filler to suck up the solution. So press A and deflate the pipette filler. Hold the pipette near the top and gently insert it into the bottom of the pipette filler. Don't push it too hard as you might break it and injure yourself. Now, take solution Q and place the pipette into the solution and press S to suck up the solution. Fill the pipette halfway because we just want to rinse the solution. Now hold the pipette in a horizontal position and roll it so that the uh, solution contacts all parts of the internal walls of the pipette. Once you are done, we will discard the solution by pressing E to remove the solution or another simple way is just to remove the pipette filler. Once all the solution have been discarded, you are done with rinsing and we can place it back to the stand and it's ready to use for titration. Remember to close the stop cork before filling it with distilled water. Use a filter funnel to help to pour the distilled water from the top. Fill a third of the burette Remove the filter funnel. Remember to rinse the tip. So now, open the stop cord, let the distilled water run. Then hold the burette horizontally and rotate it so that the distilled water contacts all parts of the internal wall. Then after that, we can discard the distilled water. And lastly, remember to discard the water from the tip as well by opening the stop cord. Once this is done, we can rinse the burette with the solution that they should contain. Repeat the steps to rinse the burette with the solution. Make sure the stop cork is closed. Place the funnel at the top. For this experiment, we are using solution R. Remember to remove the filter funnel. Remember to rotate the burette. And discard all the solution, including the solution at the tip. Once this is done, place the burette back onto the stand and both pipette and burette are ready to use for titration. 